Hello guys and welcome back to Asgol on Skyrim the Thieves Guild uh, where we left off we did some crap Oh wait before that I've got Mark with me Oh! <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while thanks for having me back on yes. I've missed, I've missed yes. gaming with you guys And people have missed you like they comment they're like where's Mark we don't like you give us back Mark I'm like yeah, okay right. fine no. So I don't exactly recall where I last left off because it's been like a week since I played or two weeks or something like that. It's been a I while. I have no idea. It's been a while. Um, but I did something for the Briar lady. Um, she probably said, you're amazing and yeah. if, if you want we could date later. I, I probably humbly declined. And, yeah, uh, you might be confusing uh, that with, with yeah. real life, what oh. females generally say. Oh, oh yeah. That's, and, you know, I go out, you know, to get something to eat, and they're just like, wow, I can tell he owns at games. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, Mercer Frey has something to say to me, so let's talk to this fool. Okay. I've consulted my contacts regarding the information you recovered from Golden Flow Estate, but no one can identify that symbol. Oh, really? I've consulted my contacts regarding the information you recovered from Golden Flow Estate, but no one can identify that symbol. Oh, really? It would seem our adversary is attempting to take us apart indirectly by angering Maven Blackbriar. Maven, that's what he is. Very that's clever. Oh, Maven Blackbriar, yeah. Maybe we should recruit them. I don't know. I don't know. You admire them? Hmm? They're well funded. Hmm? They've been able to avoid identification for years. I'm impressed it reached this point. Just don't mistake my admiration for complacency. Our nemesis is going to pay dearly. How can we make them pay? Because Mercer Frey. After all their <laughs> oh my god. Planning, they've made a mistake. <gasps> The parchment Tell me more. mentions a god lie. According to my sources, that's an old alias used by one of our contacts. His real name is Gullamai. <laughs> the plot thickens. Where do I begin? Gullamai is our inside man at the East Empire Company in Solitude. I'm betting he acted as a go-between for the sale of Golden Glow Estate and that he can finger our buyer. Get out there, shake him down, and see what you come up with. Talk to Brynjolf before you leave if you have any questions. Oh hell yeah! I will speak to Brynjolf, because he's my boy! Sweet. Okay, before I do any of that, someone said, Asgo, I hate your voice! Turn on the subtitles, because you're a bitch! What? So I'm gonna Who turn said on the that? I don't know, some, some troll. I don't know, let's see. So I'm gonna turn on the subtitles, just in case he wasn't a troll. This is for you! Maybe troll. As soon as I find the subtitle options, dialogue subtitles, boom. I'll even turn on the general subtitles. Oh, I'm such a nice guy. I got all the nice upgrades. Let's see. If I just tab out, it should save, right? Saving. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. Must feel pretty nice. It feels good. Oh, look at those. Look at that. Now you guys can read it. Oh really? Don't Talk to me, Brynjolf. He could scam a beggar out of his last septum, but he's no mastermind. Don't get me wrong. He could what? scam a you beggar out of trouble. What? You just said that. He's one of the most stubborn lizards I've ever met. You have your work mark. cut out for you. So how do I get him to talk, Brynjolf? You're going to have to buy him off. It's the only way to get his attention. If that fails, follow him and see what he's up to. If I know Gullamai. He's in way over his head, and you'll be able to use it as leverage. Cool. Hmm. What do I... I haven't decided, actually. Am I going to be, like... Like a good thief or a bad thief? Is there a good thief? Sure, I mean, like, you don't kill anybody, or you kind of honor amongst right. thieves kind of attitude. Yeah, you just steal all their possessions. <laughs> kind of a, like a happy-go-lucky kind of thief. I, As opposed I to like guess. a mean and broody thief. I don't know, maybe like like a Han Solo thief, like a smuggler. Yeah, like he's charming. A smuggler. Like okay, I, I, could I wouldn't dig consider that. him a bad guy. I'd no, I wouldn't either. Guy. I could I could dig that. Like he's like only steals from like major corporations. Nothing personal. Doesn't work for either side. But anyway, Vic so victimless crimes. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> 
Because um, I have this thing, betrayal or not, I'll let him live, or he's going to owe us for this betrayal, or if he's betrayed us, I'll kill him. So it's like, huh, I guess I hadn't thought of it. Oh! Keep alive. I guess my indecisiveness got him to just drop the conversation altogether. Okay, here we go. Um, I'll say betrayal or not, I'll let him live. I'm glad to see you're embracing our methods. It would be a waste to lose a contact at the East Empire Company before <gasps> we had the entire story. Oh my god. Just keep on Golemai's tail, and he's bound to step into something. It's a cool that little reference. Um, East Empire Company? Who are they? That's so cool. Um, <laughs> you play Morrowind. Um, East Empire Company are holed up in... Do you remember the town, Mark? East, East Empire Company. Uh, was it Balmora? Isn't it the same town that Creeper's in? Oh, that's uh, Caldera. 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 Yeah. However, however you say it. Yeah. However, I think, yeah. I think that's where their like main thing is. That's so badass. Yeah. Um, let's see. I'm not going to ask any of this stuff. I'm just going to leave. Yeah, I love when they, uh, when they you know, cross-reference things like that to... Uh, you know, you go, oh yeah, this is this is the Elder Scrolls games. You know, uh, it all shares the same the same lore. So same uh, world, yeah. Yeah. So if you have played some of the other games, it's just a little bit more rewarding. Yeah, it's a little bit more depth that you're not gonna get if you haven't played them. I mean, you can st you can play every single Elder Scrolls game as a standalone game. You know, I'm sh as I'm sure thousands of thousands of people have realized since the, their first Elder Scrolls game is probably Skyrim. Yeah. Um, you, know, you can play it as a standalone game, but it's it's just like Mark said, it's, it's just more rewarding to have played other games. You, you get all the references, you kind of understand what things right, are upon hearing you. about them. I know you're in the yeah, like, and then there's little little Easter eggs and stuff like that too, where, you know, it's like yeah. just meant for you. Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's fun stuff. It's so fun. Oh boy. So goofy. Let's see. Yeah, I'm actually, uh, I'm, I'm <laughs> really close to that quest that you just picked up from, uh, was it Brindyolf or, or Mercer or whoever. Hmm. Serving jail time causes some skills to lose their accumulated progress. Um, what's interesting is that um, going to jail in other Elder Scrolls games would cause some skills to actually, like, de-level, but some <laughs> other skills would actually level up too. So really? Like, yeah, if you went to jail... Um, it was possible that maybe your strength would go down by one or two, yeah. but your like security or speech craft might go up by like one or two. That's awesome. Yeah, it's because like jail life comes with its own set of skills <laughs> and stuff. Yeah, for real. Like um, I would think maybe intelligence because like you have nothing to do but just sit there and read or something. Yeah. Oh <laughs> Jesus! I am totally screwing up my map. Let's see, where, oh, am I supposed is... to, where am I supposed to go? Yeah, whenever I would get, uh, you know, caught by a guard or something in Oblivion, I would just reload the, <laughs> the game. I'd be like, nope, not gonna, <laughs> not gonna happen. <laughs> yeah, I, I generally don't like to reload unless, like, some kind of huge, huge just blunder happens. Can I just fast travel here? Is this what's gonna happen? You have not discovered this place yet. I cannot fast travel across the map. Yeah. <sighs> Have you been taking the carriages? No, but there's one right here. So we'll yeah. see if this if this uh It's it's pretty cool, like um I, I thought that the carriages would charge by distance, but it looks like they charge by um uh like how early on in the game you, you kind of are. Like as soon as you go to Whiterun, like you can walk to Whiterun from uh from River Riverwood. Uh, yeah. But like it immediately, like one of your first quests is join the Imperial Legion or join the Stormcloak, whatever. So you can't really, if you have it on difficulty adept or greater, you can't just walk from, you know, uh, White White Run all the way to Solitude. I mean, you'll come in contact with like a bear or something like, and unless you're really good at the game, you'll probably get you know your butt handed to you. So the carriage is right there, and I think. Even whoever assigns you the quest is just like, yeah, I'll take the carriage. And you notice that like, um, it's only 20 gold to go from White Run to Solitude, which is just like a huge section of the map. But if you want to go to White Run to say, I think like Dawn Star or something like that, you know, it's it's it might even be a little bit closer. Um, it's I think like 50 gold, even though it's closer because it's you you know it's a little bit later on in the game. It probably assumes that you have a little bit more money if you're going to be going there anyways. Yeah, it's kind of interesting. 
Let's see. I will go to solitude Climbing for 20 gold. Do that. I'm doing it. Uh, climbing back and we'll go. We'll, we'll take a... Huh. Yeah. First Little carriage ride. It's like a long taxi. Taxi ride. The guy's like, I ever tell you about the time? And he's just like, oh my god. <laughs> Weeks of this. That's pretty pro. That looks like a really cool bow. I want that bow. Give me that bow. Take loading that screen. bow. Loading screen. I think I think the loading screens are pretty cool in uh, Skyrim. Yeah. Give you little tips and also show you cool stuff. Whoa. Uh, as go, okay. I know you're playing the PC version of Skyrim. Uh, I am actually playing the 360 version, and the load screens take forever. Okay. They are so <laughs> long. It's oh man, like literally, if I have like a little bit of paperwork, homework, something to do, like I could, I can game and play at the same time. I could literally take like a minute or two while these load screens are, you know, on to do whatever. Yeah, what's what's nice is in the PC version, the load screens are actually pretty short. Lucky. I don't feel like I have to wait around at all. It's pretty cool. Man, that's cool. Let's go to Solitude. It's a cool name for a city. Solitude. Yeah. It's uh, also kind of describes my sex life. It's oh, maybe, maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you said it. Whoa! Tell them you didn't do it. I will Position. destroy Uncle Roger. I don't know. Everyone's talking. Little child chatting with some older man. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, uh, they're about to execute some people. I bet. Oh. Can I? Can I watch? Get in there. Can I? Can I be the one who swings the axe? Get, <laughs> Get on with that! Get on. <gasps> no! <laughs> you don't even know the guy! <laughs> he betrayed the... <laughs> Betrayer! Yeah. Betrayed me! Oh no! Such is our way! Such is the ancient custom of Skyrim oh. and all lords! Boo! <laughs> oh, his head's going down to the chopping block. <laughs> Maybe? You gonna push him down? Yep, there it is. That's it. I'll save him. I'll save him. I know exactly what to do. You do not. I'll save his life! <laughs> no! <laughs> there, goes, there goes his head. Oh, he's still blinking. No, he's, he's not. Still, I'm what? dead serious. Are you serious? Oh, and now his That's eyes just closed for good. He was still uh, blinking? No way, yeah. are you serious? I'm dead serious. His eyes were open, and they blinked once, and then they closed forever. Oh, uh, that's, that's, um, you know, there has, have been uh, some speculations about how long your head lives after it's been decapitated from your body. <laughs> yeah. Some people say it's a couple seconds, actually, that your head lives detached from your body. Pretty gruesome. Yes. Pretty interesting. Feel free, make Feel free to make requests. Well, uh, what kind of requests can I make, little uh, Lisette? There's nothing like a good Isaac. song. <laughs> oh, good song. Psh, I don't need to hear your stupid songs. I just wanted to see you naked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um. Not a big deal. So, Asgul, what? What? Okay. Are you going with the Stormcloaks or the Empire in, in your Neither! I am neither. a thief! I am a Han thief. Solo. The Stormcloaks He's and Solo. the uh, Empire are just uh, two sides of the same coin. Well, have yeah. you, have, do you understand, like, the struggle between them? Oh, like, psh, do I understand? Listen, I played through the beginning like everybody else, okay? Like <laughs> <laughs> okay, well... I'm just saying, like, there's some things that, like, you know, you talk to people about, you read some books about, and you can understand the plight a little bit better. John, <laughs> Mark. I'm not interested in that stuff. I'm a thief, okay? I just want to make a living. Okay, well, uh, as as you, like, Asgul, not your character, but do you oh, take any My character's in name it? is Asgul, so... <laughs> <laughs> I hate all the there Asgul's. Is, there is no differentiation. I... I am Asgul. I am hate... <laughs> Full of hate. Um, when I do the main quest, I actually am undecided. I have no idea who I'm going to join. Um, funny enough, actually, I, I think that the main quest does not have anything to do with Empire or 
Stormcloak. Like, you can... You don't have to join either one of those to beat the game and progress in the main quest. Hmm. I, I don't believe. I don't think so. Um, yeah, but, because... Well, I'll just let you figure, figure out okay. why. But, okay. um, yeah, like, it's... From what I've noticed, it's not black and white. Like, there are no good guys and bad guys. Um, it's like, you know, the Empire's bad or whatever. It's It seems pretty shades of gray, let's say. Yeah, it's, that's my favorite type of conflict yeah. in games. Like, I typically, and then there are exceptions to the rule, I don't like games where it's like, these are good guys and these are bad guys. Like, it's... I like games or stories or plots where it's just perspective, you know? Same. It's all kind of relative or subjective. Um, yes. Yeah, it's just, it, is, it just kind of takes away from it. It's just like, well, I'm doing this because I'm a bad guy. It's I just am like, evil. great, great. Just, that's <laughs> For a great reason. evil! Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's exactly right. Gollum so, E.I. what do we something. have here? Mm -hmm. Let me guess. guess. By yourself, yeah, it's, you were from the it's, I don't know, I, I have one character who's Stormcloak and one character who's, uh, not Stormcloak. Empire. I don't deal in land or property. Now if you're looking for goods, you've come to the right person. You can drop the act now. Oh, bitch. <laughs> Did you say Golden Glow Estate? Uh, my apologies. Item. I'm sorry huh. to say I know very little about that uh, bee farm, was it? <laughs> maybe I did, yeah. maybe I didn't. I can't be expected to remember every deal I handle. Oh, psh. Huh. I can persuade. <laughs> Mark! Uh, yeah. This game gets me really excited. <laughs> this game Forgive makes me please. gassy. <laughs> <laughs> I... Give me I have no excuses. Name, or I'll kill you. Hmm. I can try to persuade him, but if I try to persuade him, then it's possible that I won't be able to, like, you know, do any of his other options. Maybe just be safest to try to bribe him. Let's try it. Well, now that you mention it, there is something I've been trying to get my hands on. Ooh. I have a buyer looking for a case of Firebrand wine. There just so happens to be a single case in the Blue Palace. Bring it to me. And we'll talk about Golden Glow Estate. Damn. So I have to do this little side quest with this noob. <laughs> it's like, hey, if you bring it to me, I'll talk to you about. It's like I have a sword. It's, like it's, I'll just I'll shove it in your face. Like, well, if if you talk to Brynjolf right, and uh, you know you said, hey, maybe I should just force him. He said that that he was what was it? It wasn't a shadow scale. It was something. But he basically said you'd have your work cut out for you. And Brynjolf actually suggests bribing him. I guess the fight would be pretty tough. <laughs> you're a I'm, thief, you're not a warrior. Dude, I'd just sneak up behind him for my crit damage. Yeah, laugh all day as the poison seep into his <laughs> body and attack his heart as I laugh. Yeah, that's what would happen. If you hear this sound at your funeral, it's just me laughing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Something to that effect. If anyone knows what... If anyone knows what that reference is from, you get plus one internet points. You, you help me. Plus one oh. internet points. Right. And Josh gets one copyright fee. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> that is truth. That's okay. Yeah. That is okay. You know what? I don't I don't need I don't need this. Oh, <laughs> Blue Palace discovered. I discovered it. It was mine. Let's see. Blue Palace. Yeah. So yeah. he wants me to bring him, you know, he's an alcoholic, and so what he wants is for me to bring him some fire whiskey or something yeah. to that effect. Fire wine. Isn't that cool? He doesn't want money or anything, he just wants some liquor or wine, whatever. I think he said that there was a client or something that wanted it. Ah, you're a right. A clev clever excuse. Like, really? We all just <laughs> want to suck it down. Yeah. Really? This is how easy it's going to be? Give me that. Yeah, I thought that was kind of, kind of simple. Yeah, There's, they're not even like patrolling or anything. No, just yeah, like, just, just, just go grab it, it and leave. I know. And so the the question that becomes like, if we want to dwell on this, which I kind of I kind of want to, the question becomes: Is this really helpful to the gameplay? 
like doing this side mesh mission, this little side quest that is literally nothing but walking and then pressing two buttons, is is that was that worth it? I mean, in terms of the developer, when you're thinking, well, how can we make this quest more interesting? Like, is that what is that the, like the pinnacle of what they could have done? <laughs> it just well, I mean, it's it, it kind of makes sense. I mean, um, I, I I was stomping through the game on you know adept difficulty or whatever, and uh, it it was kind of easy. Like, you know, why why go through another quest when you can just brandish your sword and be like, you know, I'll beat you. But it's like if you're playing on a higher difficulty. That may not, you know, be an option. Like, what if there's like a real hardcore gamer and he wanted to just, uh, you, you know, I don't know, play by the difficulty? Like Brynjolf said, this guy knows how to fight. So, I mean, maybe you no, wouldn't have to do like the little thing. Maybe that makes I sense, didn't but, understand. But with the bribe, like you're already bribing him anyway. Yeah. Would it have been more effective just to hand over some of your gold? As opposed to run around and then do that really pointless, simple like it's, and it's, unfun it's, thing. It's not the, up to the developers. The guy didn't want gold. I mean, no one can <laughs> change that. He <laughs> no wanted the fire one. It. He wanted that fire He one. told That's the, true. the developers are just like, we're just going to have the main character give you gold. And he's like, no, no. <laughs> I don't know. It's like, well, could we at least uh, put some guards? It's like, well, we can't make the owner of the manor hire more people. <laughs> I mean, he's, he's pretty, he's pretty pressed as is. Uh, you know, his fire wine isn't selling. I don't know. So it's just, it's just kind of interesting. Like, it's not a big point of contention or anything, but it's just when, when playing games, I kind of think like that. It's just the developers could have just as easily said, okay, well, you bribe them, and so you give them money, and then you can keep going on with what's actually fun, as opposed to just kind of running. It's like, why did they decide that over something else? It's just kind of interesting. Yeah, you know, it's... Talk to this guy. I don't know, maybe oh, some people, maybe some people dig it. Hand it over, and we'll talk. Uh, maybe. I Good. have the wine. Can't have the buyer getting impatient and looking elsewhere for this, can we? Here, take this. I certainly can't use it. But I suppose I need to pay you something for the goods. What about the information? Not at all. I consider it an investment in prolonging my life. As oh, far as really? gold and low estate goes, I'll tell you what I know. I was approached by a woman who wanted me to act as the broker for something big. She flashed a bag of gold in my face and said all I had to do was pay Erengoth for the estate. I brought in the state. coin and walked away with yeah. her copy of the deed. Hmm. Did she say why she not was doing all. this? I tend not to ask too many questions when I'm on the job. I'm sure you understand. However, I did notice she was quite angry, and it was being directed at Mercer Frey. In this business, we rarely deal in names. Our identity comes from how much coin we carry. Look, that's all I know. I never promised you I'd have all the answers. Now, since our transaction is done, I'll be on my way. Hmm. Oh, yeah, it's telling me to shadow him. I was like, I wonder if I should shadow him now. That's the that exact quest I'm exactly on right exactly what he's doing. Shadow okay, him. he walked out, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna walk out this to Hopefully he's far enough away so he doesn't see me right away. Oh, what's your, where is he? What's your sneak level at? Not very high. I think 40. Um, that's probably around where mine is, too, you know give or take like one or two levels. Two? Huh, huh, huh. Sneak. Yeah, <laughs> my sneak's 38. Let's see. I think it's, I might be, I might be lying. I might be, or not lying, I might be lying. Because <laughs> <Right. laughs> I'm lying, I know what it is that I am. Just, oh, it's 40. Right. It's, it's only 40, or it's really it's high and it's 40. Don't fiddling with any locks around here. We're going to have a real problem. Listen, if you keep talking to me while I'm trying to sneak, we're going to have a real problem. Okay. <laughs> I'm behind these trees. Okay, cool. Oh, what? What? Trees. How am I detected? Who detects me? I'm amazing. Oh. So, Asgore, when you were when you were mentioning when you were like, um, uh, at where I can't remember when you were in public and some some girl sees you and says, "Oh, I could tell that he owns games." Like, <laughs> I don't know. It's it's funny because like, I don't believe your audience knows like what you look like. Like, for all they know, you could be like a head on a plate, like playing games <laughs> with like your mind. No, I'm a disembodied voice. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty cool. What are you trying to say that I that 
women wouldn't approach me? Is that what you're trying to say? They don't know what I look like, so it's funny to you? Esgol, like, I would say that. <laughs> Esgol looks like Fabio. No, it's just funny because Fabio. because of, of everyone who's listening. Only I know what you look like. That's and true. it's it's funny. I don't I don't know. It's it's not that actually that's not true. That is oh, not is it... true. Okay, I suppose um, that's not. You know, your mom um, watches the show. I don't. Know. No, she does not. <laughs> um, but no, uh, my Skype, my Skype has a picture yeah, of me. Ah, and so true. does my Facebook. And some people are following me on Facebook and on Skype. So that's some people true. actually know what I look like. But of course, it's that screaming picture of me going like. Right, <laughs> this is. So I don't know how accurate a representation that is That's true. of how I normally look, but uh, there it is. And I have long hair in that picture, whereas I have short picture of hair yeah. now. Hippie. Hippie. I'm not a hippie. I am... I don't know. I don't I'm a hippie. Know. Uh, no. Asgold is a... He's, he's Actually, a normal looking Viking. This will be a little... Uh, what's to come i actually plan on doing a personal kind of video um pretty soon actually i was thinking about doing one for the uh the new year that's coming up sweet just kind of doing like a little personal video of kind of like new year's resolutions that'll be like a little that's a little what's to come for my skyrim fans there it is a little insight into the channel Ooh, what's he doing he's going on to a ship he's oh. probably got a contact down there Mm. He probably <laughs> meets his prostitute here once every week. Dude, that's what it is. They engage in various choking behaviors. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's see. It's those Joke. Argonians, man. Dude, they're yeah. all—they're into all kinds. Of, well, they can't drown. I mean, they've never really, you know, felt <laughs> what it's like. <laughs> felt what it's like to kind of run out of breath. So. Asphyxiation is just so different for them. It is it's so new. Oh, he's he's not going to a ship after all. He's going to some pub. Dude. Oh no, I lost sight of him. Oh, never mind. There he is. <gasps> Apparently, I'm seen. East Empire Company. Ooh. What's that guard doing right there? What the? Oh, I was hoping he'd jump over that and be all cool, but. <laughs> this huh. badass Asgore over here. Dang it. Okay, so he went into that door. I'm probably gonna get stopped by this guard. Just get out of my way. I thought he was gonna stop me, but he didn't. Okay, so I'm gonna go into the. Oh, it requires a lock. That's okay. I'm gonna pick it. Because that guard doesn't. No shit! <laughs> He's a really bad guard. He saw someone walk by. Just whatever. He's not even gonna look at me as he I does. walk past. He doesn't mind. Whoa, who's that guy? He's like, I'm holding a sword, and it's bloody, and I have a weird hood. Actually, it kind of looks like the Assassin's Creed hood. I'm a Dunmer Sweet. with an Assassin's Creed hood. Yeah, it could be like a little uh, ode to another video game. I know there is a perk on the Conjuration tree that says Dark Souls. Nice. So that's pretty sweet. Let's see. Okay, so I, I, I imagine I'm going to have to be like super stealthy now. I followed him into a locked door. Like I'm pretty sure, if he sees me, I'm gonna lose this mission or whatever. Yeah, I'm. I'm currently on that mission right now, and uh, I've run into a couple guards, um, but he hasn't seen me personally. So. Hmm. Um, He's just chilling. I don't know, man. He has a lot of friends. <gasps> There's a guard right there. Fuck. That's <laughs> <laughs> gone. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, how can I do this? Maybe when he walks by, I can like jump down. All the kids at home are now tainted. What was that? With the blood of the innocent. Time to end the blood of the no, innocent. he did not detect me. He did not detect me. He's full of it. You have no. to baptize him in blood and fear. That's what I do to all my viewers. <laughs> <laughs> right. Uh, I remember my first baptism. Blood and fear. Okay. I am no longer being detected. Dude, this is awesome. Oh, there's another guard over there, though. And he's going to be, like, looking up. And he's going to be like, who's that noob? Check My name's it. Asgul, and I'm trying to shadow this Argonian. Please don't Please. talk to me. <laughs> no. Come on, just let me jump across. Piece of crap game. Actually, this game's awesome. I wonder if I stop being stealth just for a second to make this jump. If everyone will be like, hey! Whatever, I'm gonna stay stealth. Made it, because I'm a boss. 
Ah, oh, but there's a big freaking thing here. Whatever. I have to drop. No, there's no one here. Shut up. You shut your face. Shut oh, your man. shut your hole. Dang it. I wonder if I can. Ah, oh, when you swim, you're not like sneaking though. No, you're not sneaking. You can't brandish a weapon. You can't do any spells. You're just kind of dead in the water, so to speak. <laughs> Come on, be awesome. Go fast. He doesn't need to see you. He's a noob. What was that? That's nothing. You shut your mouth. Now, hopefully, he'll go where he saw me, not where I am. If he turns around and he looks right here, then I'm going to be discovered. And that's just all there is to it. And the eye is getting bigger. Oh, now it's getting smaller. Just fight him, man. Just kill him. No, I can't. Oh, you know what's awesome? Uh, the torches along the walls, you can activate them and then put them into your inventory to make it darker, to make sneaking easier. Oh, that sounds awesome. Isn't it? Yes. Well, I tried to activate torches uh, earlier. There was actually an earlier point in the game where I tried to do that and it didn't work. <gasps> Guard. Were there torches on the wall or no torches when you activated it? Listen, there was something on the wall, and it was, like, all there. It said it activate new. torch? No, it didn't say that. That's my point. What are you talking about? Nothing. I don't... I'm trying I, to concentrate. What are you <laughs> talking about? Okay, well, some of them do. You can take the torches off the walls. That's my point. Okay. Point taken. Good. I thought I saw two people. There's a goat in the water. I saw that same goat! Why is he there? <laughs> just He's just chilling! That's just... so weird. Why? Why is I don't whatever. Hello? <gasps> he turned around! No! No! That goat's no. all chilling. No. 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 No, he's not gonna come over here. Why would he do that? Oh, but he's gonna come over here. He's gonna see me. Why would he turn around? Why would this happen? Jeez. Oh, he didn't notice me. <laughs> that guard is going to, though. <laughs> no. Oh, nice. Man, I am too cool. <laughs> uh, <sighs> yeah, no comments. Did he swim in there? Did he just... Where did he... Why is he... Who did he... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, he went to a door. He must have traveled underneath the water somehow. Oh, yeah, he that, traveled underneath that the water. took me like five minutes to find. I'm going to find it in like 30 seconds. Well, you know, I was simultaneously trying to be entertaining, so I don't know what your excuse is going to be. That's what I'm doing. Oh, yeah, I <laughs> Oh, I am so awesome. Let's go to Brine Water Grotto. I love this environment. It looks so nice. <sighs> Combat-based magic only improves when used against valid opponents. I wonder what they consider a valid opponent. I know in um, previous Elder Scrolls games, you could actually summon creatures and then use magic on the creatures you summoned to like grind. Yeah, that's uh, that, that's what I've been doing with my mage. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm oh, using this tripwire. Oh, um, dude! I activated that tripwire. You got it. I um. caught it. Yeah, with my mage, I am I am using a flame atronach, or however you pronounce that, and uh, it's yeah, pretty I don't sweet. Atronach. Yeah, though. I, I always say atronarch. Atronach. There, there isn't another R, so I don't know why I say that. I always say <laughs> astronach, which I don't know. Whatever. What, what <laughs> it's <was> weird. <gasps> no, no, I'm nobody. I'm nothing. I'm a shadow. Cause you know one. Oh. Sh um. Yeah, but it's cool. Like my atronach will run up to some guy. And be all in his face, and then I'll just coat the whole freaking thing with fire hands. And uh, the Atronach is resistant to flame, like 100%, so it's cool. They don't take damage. Well, I just, I freaking spray and pray that whole thing. Feels, <sighs> feels good. That must be awesome. It is. So I don't know if I have, like, a no-kill order. I don't recall them ever saying that I couldn't kill people. But at any rate, I just got to... Like, someone heard me, and so they started walking, and they walked all the way to the entrance, so I had to walk out of the brine water. Oh my god. Out. You are. So now I'm gonna have to go back in. And hopefully, there's not someone standing right in front of me. That is. <laughs> just okay. just kill him, man. Just kill him. You didn't get the no kill order. There's nothing wrong with that. I don't want to kill anybody. I'm such a nice guy. He's such a solo Han, solo thief, solo. No, he is not gonna turn around. You know, as he I recall, does. actually. Han Solo was a smuggler, not a thief. I don't think he actually stole, he just transported. 
You are I'm evil. Still. I'm not evil. <laughs> well, you're not hot solo. Dude, in order to smuggle things, you're probably stealing it from someone to smuggle it to someone else. No, like, the, the thief gives it to you, and then you transport it. You didn't actually do the stealing. Well, you're just as bad. <laughs> I, I, maybe. I, <laughs> you know it's stolen. Yeah, it you is. Know it's stolen. Of course it's stolen. Engineer work. Oh, I cannot believe that there's... There. What? You did not detect me. He's a piece of crap. Hey, maybe I could use this to my bench. Maybe while he's investigating, I can run around. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> you get out of my face, bandit! <laughs> Just maybe you can run all the way through. You can sneak while tanking all of their attacks. No. <laughs> he's hitting me. <laughs> this is what's happening. I'm fighting. I am openly fighting a thug. It had to happen. He's okay. running away? Oh, how do you like getting shot in the face? I should've just opened fire to avoid this. What, he's a spray of water? He won't go anywhere in water? Whoa. Juked it. Now you're dead. Where's your buddy at? Oh, You're so cute. Oh, he's not so cute. Uh oh. In fact, I'm taking a lot of damage. Oh no! Ah. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna loot this guy! Do it. Give me all your goods! Give me your... I'll show you a real fight. Your goodies. Whoa. He's going to show me a real fight, he says. Oh. He attacked me quickly a second time, and I died. I was about to take one more hit. I was like, okay, I'll, I'll drink after this one last hit. And uh, so he hit me. And then, like, before an animation even went off, he just hit me twice. I was There's like, damn it. There. Jeez. Okay, well, while I'm sneaking, if I can't get past him, I guess I'm just going to have to kill him. Which makes me feel like a noob. This does not feel very thievey at all. It is. It's kind of thief slash adventurous. Like I think it is expected that you fight. I think that's a bad expectation. <laughs> suffers because of it. Look, if you had a hundred sneak with invisibility potions, we wouldn't be having this conversation. Times two damage. Oh yeah, that's right. I suppose it would have been my times two. Oh no! Get away from me! I'm epic. Aha! Uh oh, this guy pulled out a dagger. Oh, he's gonna die when we hit that. <laughs> noob. You should have adventured more than I did in order to beat me. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Yeah. Uh oh. Okay. Now I'm gonna, you know, drink all my potions. I could just pull out a melee weapon, but that would defeat my archetype. So I don't wanna do that. Uh oh. Okay. Uh -oh. I'm in trouble. You're I'm just using him. you're using a bow the oh. entire time? Yeah. Oh no. oh no. Too cool for school. No. Don't give me a real fight. I don't want a real fight. Oh, I got no. him. I got him. I got him. He's dead. Good. The thug is dead. <laughs> you're really getting a lot out of this game. I'm so annoyed. I'm so annoyed that I had to do that. That I had to. They're just like standing right here. How can they get around us? You, <sighs> you committed murder. I murdered two <laughs> people. Well, more like I defended myself against two people. No, you broke and into their, their place. <laughs> and then they were like, we're going to defend ourselves. And you're like, no, you're going to die. Oh, <laughs> that's true. It's okay. No, it's not okay. Bring off. It's going to be like, I thought I told you. Like, man. No, oh, you just made that up. You didn't tell me anything. That's what I will say. And then you'll say, You're out of the Thieves Guild, asshole. <laughs> but what about my channel? I know. Like, what do you mean? <laughs> like, nothing. <laughs> no, <for laughs> I like how the lock picking in this is like almost exactly like Fallout 3. Is that. That's a guy naked in the water, but he's got a weapon on his back. What is he doing in there? Just. Having a dip. <laughs> He's like, well, there might be a weird bugs and fish in here, but uh, fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> There's another guy right there. Ah. Uh, uh, well, what is what is it about just my presence that brings out the worst in you verbally? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Something. Let's see. So that is that is a horrible, horrible word. Abhorrible. Despicable. <laughs> 
<laughs> I am despicable. I'm sorry to all those. Whoa! Is that a spider? That is a big spider. Why? Why do they exist? <laughs> I hate them. I hate them. I, I hate them. 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 Whatever. There's a big. There's a big spider web right there. But I suppose it's either kill the spiders or kill these guys, assuming they both paths lead to the same place. The spiders aren't like people. Like they're bugs. Yeah, and I. You're right. I don't know where I was going. <laughs> <laughs> It's so good. Yeah, just in, just in case you had noticed. Oh, right. Helping you out. There's a reason you have me on here. To point that's out, true. that's a guy. That's a bug. <laughs> that's a guy. You can tell because that one has two legs and that one has eight legs. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Mark. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and by the way, I caught that episode of Diablo 3 where you said that I'd be creeping <laughs> on people freaking binoculars typical mark behavior what the I, I don't understand oh that guy's a mage oh but that person mage just died in one hit yeah Asgore likes to bust on me when he thinks I'm not around I'm around <laughs> see <laughs> see he's a creeper <laughs> I'm not a cre I was spying I was spying on the episode I I, no, I he just said it. he's around cut like. it on and then watched my computer through the window outside with binoculars. <laughs> see? See? <laughs> I thought I was just making a joke. No. He's, he's around. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, so that is what that was. That's what I thought it was. I, you could go and you could kill the spiders in order to avoid the people. And I just killed the people. I hate myself. <laughs> like there is just a certain amount of self-loathing that goes on when I do something stupid. And I just wish I hadn't. Damn it. It's okay. You couldn't have known. I could have known. I oh. could have at least tried. <laughs> and I didn't. I didn't. You decided okay. to That's okay. Heal. So, when you swim, do you know? Oh. Alternate path? I know. Yes. I know. What do I know? What was that? It was nothing. Shut up. Okay. Stupid thief. Thug. Bandit. Dick. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Whoa. Another tripwire. Not the did anything I guess awkward anyway um do you know if you swim are you out of sight you know well if you're like swimming in the water underneath the water will someone above you just be like I see you and just like point at you and just come try to kill you I don't know I don't know um I could speculate that you know if it was night or if the lighting conditions were darker they have less of a percentage chance to see you, but I, I know you're not sneaking when you're when you're swimming. Maybe right. if you go deeper underwater and if it gets mur murky, I I'm not really sure. I just killed a dog. That's kind of sad. Yeah, I know. Is this some random dog? I I just got done uh, chopping him up. Actually. <laughs> 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 yeah. Uh, little dog bits. Dog meat. It's another Bethesda. Thing. Let's see. Hello. 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 Yeah, I'm. I'm pretty positive that there is a way that even with a lower sneak, that it's there? it's possible that you would be able to get through this hole. Oh come on! Yeah, you can make invisibility no. potions at no. low level. I'm gonna try to run away. And I'm gonna try to sneak again, and I wonder if they'll know where I am. That will never work. Yeah, invisibility potions, man. They're, oh, they're great. They're just right on my butt. Yeah, I don't, I don't have invisibility. I probably have some, but I just didn't want to use them. And, um, yeah, you can now. you can make them. I mean, they only was like two ingredients or something like that. Uh, yeah, but my guy's not an alchemist. Okay. You know what? That's, that's actually... You know what? I believe alchemy in this game is a thief skill. Which is kind of yeah. weird. I don't, I don't agree with that at all. How? What does that have to do with thieving? Mixing, mixing potions. Yeah. So, alchemy. Yeah. Oh well. Okay. Well, to be fair, it kind of lies between the green blue border. But okay, I am at the level up screen right now, and it is green. Okay. The little star symbol shines, shines green. So. Uh, there it is. Juke. Oh man, me and this archer just 
<laughs> this is ridiculous. We both lose like five arrows. There, fine. Yeah. I hit her once. Uh, then she hit me too, of course. Um, Asgul, what's? Have you noticed that there are some skills that lie in between? Oh come on! Am I all out of arrows? No. I'm not. What the heck? Yeah, enchanting is half, half fighting and half magic. It's right in between the two on the upgrading. It's kind of purple instead of blue and red. Maybe that means it's both. Huh. And then uh, let's oh, see. I'm almost dead. Looks like light armor lies right between sneaky and uh, fighty. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, and it's yellow. It's it symbols yellow instead of red or green. And it looks like archery. Yes. Archery might even be a little a little bit in between too. That's so weird. Whatever. And now you die. Just... Time to die. She put up a good fight, though. Wasn't good enough. <laughs> there you go murdering people again. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm so bad. I'm so bad at this game. Okay. I'll continue our creeping. Now that everyone's dead. You know, I'm sure it doesn't matter at this point. I, I really, really wish that I hadn't have done that just now, but I did. It is done. Look, I, chest. I'm pretty sure you have to fight people no matter what. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> That's what people say when they can't do it. Oh, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Ooh, lockpicks. And a soul gem that I'll probably never use. Maybe I could sell it. Oh. Enchanting is a lot of fun in this game. I haven't done it. I haven't done anything. All I've done is sneak and use my bow. I haven't smithed or enchanted or cooked. Done any kind of leather working. Leather. Work Whoa. Working. Little game glitch there. As you guys can see, the water disappears. You know, I'm looking at it for a certain angle. I've noticed there has been... A slightly larger amount of glitches in this game than I would expect from a Bethesda game. That's kind of funny that you say that because most people expect a lot of bugs in Bethesda games. <sighs> they're actually kind of, they're, they're actually kind of known for their bugs. I guess I don't know. I'm a fanboy. I'll admit that right now. I love Bethesda. Me too. Oh Jesus, yeah. And now that you mention it, uh, Fallout 3 did have its fair share. And uh, isn't there some saying with Bethesda about uh, horse armor? Not that I'm aware. I think, yeah, it's like a where's the horse armor, uh, because I believe in Elder Scrolls 2 or something like that. I, I, and again, I may be mistaken, this is just from what I've heard. Uh, there was, yeah, armor for horses available for purchase, and I guess it was pretty expensive, and uh, some, you know, giant attainable thing, whatever, and uh, when you got it, lo and behold, you find out that the horse armor actually does nothing for defense. It's just some <laughs> stupid little thing that costs a whole lot, and no, I heard that that was a common saying. Yeah, I don't know. I didn't start playing the Elder Scrolls games until Morrowind. So I actually have no experience with the first two. Which is Arena and Daggerfall. I think it's Daggerfell. Ugh. Oh. I, oh. I'm really not sure. Asgore! <laughs> <laughs> actually! And I'd be the actually oh, guy. Oh, I just, just s snuck past these two wenches. Lo and behold, there's a third and fourth wench. You stole Actually, my him. lo and behold phrase. That's my phrase. That is not your phrase. I made that oh, phrase. I'll eat that phrase. <laughs> I'll tell you what you <laughs> can eat. Dang it, so he's just right there. So maybe they are kind of expecting me to kind of do open combat, at least at this point, because he's at a bonfire right now. And I, I assume if I approach him, then everyone will be like, hey. Um, yeah. But maybe if I just get a, a right angle on it, maybe it'll just be like, hey, you see what he's up to. I don't know. We'll find out in the next exciting episode. Of? Let's go Owens. Let's go Owens. No, you don't see me. They all don't see me. I'm no, they all see me. They all see of, you. Of course they all see me. I'm glitching. I'm glitching behind here. That's right. How you gonna hit me when I'm glitched up here, you noob? <laughs> he's like, he's like, I don't have to. I'll just run away. It's like that's true. That's what you will do. Isn't it? <clears throat> oh, can I hit that chick's head? No. <laughs> oh my 
my god. Actually, I might be able to... If I stay here long enough, maybe they'll just kind of lose sight of me. Can't hide from me. Yeah, they're actually losing sight of me. It's kind of cool. Are you taking advantage of game mechanics as a goal? Not a big deal. I just kind of <laughs> do an area. And, yeah, uh, just, just, I turn the difficulty down when there's a guy that's really tough. I don't do that. <laughs> you do do that! <laughs> look at my, no, you look at this. No, we're going to do this now. <laughs> this, here we go, gameplay. Oh, where's the, uh, where's the, where, I don't need, difficulty, adapt, boom. Eat it. Eat it, Kunius. Okay, okay. Adept. You know, that basically just means normal, right? Yeah, well, it's not like, uh... I don't know, do you want me to embarrass you in front of everybody? Uh, Mark, Mark plays on easy difficulty. Okay! Mark you plays know, on easy no, difficulty. No, no, listen to him! <laughs> Somebody listen to him! Look, I beat Dark Souls! I beat Dark Souls! I can do this! He has a right to an easy game, is what I, he's trying to you say. You know what? That was really tough! Dark Souls is difficult! And I can play on novice if I want to. He plays a noob. <laughs> <laughs> they call it novice, but everyone knows it's noob. <laughs> uh, maybe. Okay. This. My mage is on a death. Yeah, leveled up. So. I leveled up. You're full. I'm gonna level up right now. Oh what? Oh, almost legged out. <sighs> we'll increase the stamina. Why not? Not that I use stamina for anything. I'm so awesome. Let's see. Oh, this is what I wanted to do. How much does this cost? Yes! Sneak attack with bows. Now do three times damage. That's what I wanted. Sweet. Do you have it? I am getting it right now. Boom. Done. Ah, uh, yes. That feels Although, awesome. I kind of wanted to get, you know, you are 25% harder to detect, but whatever. We'll get... That'll come later. That'll come later. Uh, oh, that chick is gonna see me. Do not see me. The 25 right. twenty-five percent harder on sneak. That's uh, that's the first like, perk in the sneak tree, right? Yep. Okay. Yep. Yeah. And that that goes up to five, I think, right? Yes. I do believe so. Yes. You know, I mean, uh -huh. I hate I hate to kind of like nope. pick nope. Nope. to nope. nitpick or whatever, but it seems like that's nope. that seems to be most skill trees in this game. That's their first thing. It's just like twenty-five percent easier, twenty-five, you know, whatever. Right. Like, I don't know. Then again, I'm sure you've touched on this before, but this game does seem slightly more dumbed down than uh, yeah. Oblivion, what with the lack of athletics and acrobatics, just to <laughs> just to mention some things. Two, yeah. Yep, I mean, the perk system's awesome, don't get me wrong, but I mean, it is kind of simple. Yeah. It's also simple, but it's nice, it's a nice addition. Um, in Oblivion, they just had these perks, but they were just passive. So as you leveled up, you just kind of get these passive... You didn't have to click on anything, you know? It's just like, now that you're this good, you can do this. Yeah. And just kind of activate it at a certain level. And here, it's like... It's cool, too. It's it's legit. The perk it, system's cool. It's from Fallout. Yeah. Not exactly the same way Fallout works, but... You know. Yeah. So I think I just have to fight them. I don't know. I've been trying to sneak around, and they see me, and then they just engage me. The guy's right here at this bonfire... Um, I, that makes, I wonder if I'm gonna have to kill them or not, I have no idea, but, actually, I wonder if I can, sh if I'm gonna have to kill them anyway, I wonder if I can get a sneak attack, like, through these little bars here, that'd be pretty cool. Do it. Huh? I can, and I did, and I got my three times damage, and it felt great. <laughs> did you get a one-hit kill? Oh, no, I didn't. Oh. But, she doesn't notice me yet, kinda, sorta. Oh, yeah. Oop. That that stealth mode, that bow. Oh really? Did you guys see that? Of course you guys saw it. <laughs> that was ridiculous. This guy was kind of like stuck on a wall, but as soon as I loosed my arrow, he like just kind of like moved away. It was just oh, instantly. I yes, I've had people do that all the time. When you uh, you know, you get into uh that mode when you draw oh. when you draw the bow and you aim in front of them and then you loose the arrow and they stop in their tracks and the arrow goes where they would have been, like as if they know. Yeah. Oh my god. They do that all over the place. They're dancing around there. Like, they know. They're, yeah. they're actively dodging that arrow, it seems like. Yeah, so my arrows are hitting this box. So that's why they're not... I can't shoot them unless they're far enough what away. Yeah. So I can aim up higher. That is... Killed two. one. Hopefully this is good enough. Oh, he's moving away anyway. Whoa. Ah, oh, see, 
hit the hit the thing. I didn't miss. It hit the thing. <laughs> <laughs> Just want to make the distinction, cause there is one. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, shot him in the back of the brain. Uh, so I've, I've killed I've killed two of the three people that are around here that I didn't that I need to fight. Just by you know, manipulating this glitch, essentially. <laughs> oh man. Have you have you come in? I'm sure you've come in contact with some of these uh, hanging jars of like gasoline that you shoot and set up a trap. I know I yeah, it's pretty cool. It's so nice. Oh. Okay, now it's just it's just straight out fighting is what's happening. <laughs> Oh, you guys saw that juke? I'm so good. <laughs> oh, I took an arrow to the knee. <laughs> yeah. Oh, <what>? <laughs> <laughs> Don't be such a milk drinker, Asgul. Sorry. Okay, now it's time to go confront this noob. Orcish arrows. Gimme, gimme, gimme. That's pretty cool. Dude, whatever happened to that swear word, Enwa? I miss that. <laughs> it's only in a Mario. You and why? I know, but it's all the dark elves. Like you go to like the Gray Quarter in Windhelm or something. There's all these dark. Oh, you come in contact with dark elves all over the place. They can't just be like, ah, you don't know our ways. And why? And why? And why? And why? Isn't as bad as I love that one. I was gonna tell Mercer about everything. It's so funny. It's so it's nonsensical, but they say it as if it's just like just it's so much mad. You and why? Like it's like oh. Die, and why? <laughs> <laughs> ah, so cool. That's funny. Tell me first, then I'll decide. All right, all right. It's <laughs> Carlia. Call me an Enwa. Her name is Carlia. Ooh. Mercer never told you about her. Carlia no. is the thief responsible for murdering the previous <laughs> guildmaster, Gallus. <gasps> now she's after Mercer. <laughs> <laughs> so and you're helping her. Hell. No, no. Uh -huh. Look, I didn't even know it was her until after she contacted uh -huh. me. Please, you have to believe me. And what? Where is Carly now? I don't now? know. When I asked her where she was going, she just muttered, where the end began. Here, take the Golden Glow estate deed as proof. And when you speak to Mercer, tell him I'm worth more to him alive. Right on. I'll pass on your message. After I kill you, <gasps> I won't do that. I'm not gonna kill him. Not gonna kill him. Okay. What do these levers do? I'm so curious. <laughs> Pull it. Pull the lever. Pull all the levers. Well, I saw this just opened. Could probably open that gate. I suppose to jump over it. What is this? Watch, I'll like go in here and you'll pull the lever and get me shut in here. <laughs> and laugh all day. Uh. You goofy. It's just, this is it, really? There's a big cage with some salmon here. Just, no, keep your salmon locked up, boys. It's uh, <laughs> it's really, I don't know, expensive. There's, there's a bunch of chests around there. I thought, and I just gave away something. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, it's like everyone drops. You just drop your controllers. Great. <laughs> Oh god, if right, you're playing console game. Oh, that is cool. If target dies within three seconds, fills a soul gem. That's awesome. It's kind of like Umbra. It's pretty cool. Oh, right, that's uh, an enchantment. Mercer. Mark, giving away all these hints. I'm going to take advantage of it. I'm not giving away any hints. Something about a chest, something about epic loot, something about you win the game. I just said there's chests on this. <laughs> yeah. No. Insta win. Whoa. I've broken two picks. Why? Because I am a noob. Yeah. Okay, apparently this has like no direction from which it opens. This this is ridiculous. It's an adept lock, but it doesn't Oh, what's that? I've I looked here. This is baloney. Baloney. This is baloney, <laughs> mister. What are you doing that for? What are you gonna do? Stop me? That's what I thought, chump. No, no. And no. Ooh, some books. 
Some books up here. Oh, that's a chest. That's expert level. Cool. Let's read these books, so see if there's anything to learn first. Children of the Sky. Talking about Mark's ego. <laughs> My ego is <laughs> Children of the Sky. Yeah. Let's yes. See. This is an expert level. Let's do it. No. <laughs> Let's do it. Yeah. Let's break. Yeah, those those locks are pretty pretty tough. It's okay. Luckily, I've got 42 lock picks left. I don't know, that kind of oh. makes me think that maybe this was supposed to be meant for like a little later section of the game. Maybe when your lockpick skill was higher or something, I don't know. Yeah. I'm not sure either. Either that or it's just like exceptionally good loot. Yeah. Yeah, possibly. Something that you go back later for, maybe. Oh. I'm so close. Oh. Damn it. Yeah, I keep wondering too if on the Xbox version if it's easier to pick locks because you don't have to tap it so hard. That's right. Um, it's it's not too bad. Honestly, I've never had like a huge problem with it. I am encountering a huge problem now. I'm down to 36 lock picks. Down to I 36. I would kill to have 36 lock picks. Oh come on, come on. This is garbage. This is garbage. <laughs> Like they break uh, so fast because I, c I can't like tap it softly. You is, know? That, is that expert you you rock in there? Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty so cool. so close. Seems too far, I think. Oh, got it. Nice, cool. Some gold. I would learn a spell. Should I be? If I was a spell person. Some gold. Studded armor, but it gives me a little health bonus. That's kind of nice. <coughs> Let's see if that gives me more armor. I kind of doubt it. You can uh, go disenchant that and then use that effect to then to more. put a put a stronger effect on any item of your choosing. You know, if you're getting bom, into bom. enchantments, maybe. Which I'm not. Well, that's another expert level. Well, Let's do it again. It's too bad. Let's see. Oh come on, filthy, filthy. I'm sure this is the gameplay that people want to see too. Just like, <laughs> just watching me <laughs> fail locks over and over again. They're just like, "Wow, this is exciting!" It's oh like, my so god, funny. I know. This this is where our commentary has to do. We have to carry the bulk of the entertainment with our commentary here. <laughs> yeah. so you to, knock knock. <laughs> Twelve gold. Twelve gold. Expert level. Oh my god. Okay. Twelve that has to be gold. Randomized. That has to be. Randomized. That's that's all that was in there. Well, I know that loot is randomized okay. to a certain extent, but um. That is just, that is awful. That's that is miserable. Pretty bad. I don't know why someone would want to lock that up. 12 gold. <sighs> miserable. Okay, I'm out of here. I am leaving. I have successfully completed the mission because I am a succeeder. Whoa, what the frick is that? What is, what this? <laughs> really? <laughs> really, this is what's happening? This? <laughs> what? A hork? A horker? <laughs> what? Look at him waddling around on land. This is ridiculous. Uh, what? Uh. What? That looks awesome, but I really wanted to kill that horker. <laughs> God. It looked like a walrus. I was getting chased around by a walrus, and they were kind of like, ur, ur, <laughs> like chasing me on land. God, dude. All slow and stumpy. <sighs> Sorry. That is funny. It was pretty goofy. But I'm out of there now. Now it's just time to run home. Ooh, a chest. <sighs> give me, give me. Steel helmet. Won't be using that. I won't be taking that either. Give me the gold. Give me the gold. Dude, I just encountered a glitch. I don't know if anyone else did. It's pretty irritating. Um, if anyone listening has encountered the same glitch, please post about how to fix it. Uh, if you know. Um, I... I am supposed to turn in one of my pieces of guild armor to Tonalia, I, I think is her name. Uh, Tonalia, yeah. And she will then give me one better piece of armor. Um, but the problem is, as soon as I got the, the Thieves Guild armor, I traded it to her immediately because I didn't want it. I was a mage. Uh, and so now she's like, okay, well, give me one of the pieces of the old armor and I'll give you something better. So I'm just like, I don't have any of it. And she's like, that's too bad. Come back when you do. She's the only fence in the guild. Like, what <laughs> What am I supposed to? She literally has my armor and says, you better give me this armor, which I already have, or, or else nothing. And then that's my only, that's all I could say to her. 
She, she says, are you ready to trade that thing in? And I say, no. She says, come back when you do. And kicks me out of the conversation. And that's it. Oh, that sucks. But she's, it's, what a great fence, too, because she'll buy stolen goods. Do I have to recreate? Do I have to use enchanting and make a piece of armor that's exactly like it? Uh, sure. That's yeah, that sucks. I'm sorry. That's nah, all good. But yeah, leave that. Leave that Go in the comments if you guys know a fix. You guys are geniuses. Fire. You guys give me tips all the time. Yes. Help Mark out. Please. He said Golden Cow was purchased by Carlia. No, it, it can't be. I haven't heard that name in decades. Decades. This is grave Decades. She's someone I hope to never cross paths with again. Hmm. Carlia destroyed get, 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 everything get, 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 this guild get, get, get. stood for. She murdered my predecessor Great. in cold Can't blood sell anything. and betrayed the guild. Might After as well we kill myself. She done. We spent months trying to track her down, but she just vanished. Why Carlia has she and I were like partners. I went with her on every heist. We watched each other's backs. I know her techniques, her skills. If she kills me, there'll be no one left that could possibly catch her. If only we knew where she was. Hmm. There's only one place that could be. The place where she murdered Gallus. A ruin called Snowvale Sanctum. We have to go out there before she disappears again. <laughs> we? Yes, I'm going with you. Together we're going to kill her. Here's your payment for solitude. Prepare yourself and meet me at the ruins as soon as you can. We can't let her slip through <clears throat> our fingers. There it is. Completed. Scoundrel's Folly. Okay, so that about does it for this episode of Asgul Owens, uh, The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim The Thieves Guild. Um, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave them in the comment section below, and I'll be more than happy to get back to you. Remember to answer Mark's question, yeah. and if you enjoy the content, please subscribe. This is Asgol and Kunius. Thanks, guys. Been fun. Signing off.